The newly inaugurated PDPFCT state chairman Ismail Ladaugarayenchi has appreciated leaders of the party for reposing confidence in him to lead the party. Yenchi spoke when he resumed office in Abuja alongside other executives. Ismail Ladaugara was in tears over the death of his predecessor, late Sunday Zaka. <laughs> He also called on members and stakeholders of the party to support his leadership, adding that his doors are open for contribution and support. The leaders of the party in FCT have deemed it feel necessary that there is a capacity in me to at least bring people together so that at the end of the day, we can achieve the goal. What is that goal we are talking about? Achieving the goal, all political parties, their goal and objective is to win the election. And inshallah, with my ESCO, we'll do everything possible to bring the PDP party fly in FCT in the Six Area Council and the national election by the special grace of God. That is our focus. Meanwhile, members and leaders of the People's Democratic Party also commended the state PDP chairman expressing confidence in his capacity to lead the party to victory in future elections. It is my sincere expectation that with the new brand uh, of this leaders, that they should work together and see that the victory is achieved. He started from the grassroots. He knows the pace and the yearnings and, the yearnings and the aspiration of the masses of FCT, as it has to do with the party. So it will test you to know that 90% uh, of the members of the party supported him. We have risen fully. And by special grace of God, we the women, they take, carry us along. Before I was alone, but now we are six in number. So our prayer is that the next election, by special grace of God, PDP will come back fully. We won our senatorial seat and our two House of Rep and our six area council chairman. With the resumption of office by the newly inaugurated PDP state officers, the party is set to provide the needed opposition to the ruling All Progressive Congress. Abel Sunday. AGTV News.